Hello YouTube. It's been a year since I uploaded my first video on the Milwaukee tool hack. Um, basically using a power bank instead of a Milwaukee battery to power my heated jacket. And uh, it's pretty funny because I uploaded that video almost a year, a year ago to the day. And a year later it's still cold and I'm still wearing my Milwaukee jacket. Um, the only difference is I have a new connector for the battery, so I just wanted to show you that today. Um, I actually have two products to show you. We'll start with this one, and the other one is actually a USB-C adapter. So, um, let me just unhook my battery. So I was using the Milwaukee battery that comes with the jacket. Actually, the, the new jacket style is really nice. Um, in the past, I believe the only way to hold the battery in the pocket was literally right on your, your hip, kind of like your love handle right here. On these new jackets, there's actually a pocket right here, and there's a pocket that goes back here. I mean, it's one, it's one continuous pocket, but it allows you to move the battery if you're driving or, you know, if you're sitting down and you don't want to feel it on your back, you can move it to the front, and it makes it a lot easier. So. Let me just pop this open real quick. See what it says. Alright, so this is the Smarky Heavy Duty adapter. If you guys can see that. So it has the 5.5mm uh, jack as long with the as long as well with the USB. Um, let me see the product notes. It says it can only work if your jacket is a voltage of 12 volt. It can only work if, well, it can work if your power bank is a QC 3.0, QC 4.0, or a PD. And the jacket connector has to be a 5.5 millimeter. So that that was a problem that I was having with a lot of the other adapters. I mean, the other batteries. Pull out the old faithful. So this battery, I've had it for a year, and it is a 30,000 milliamp battery with a, uh, there's a bunch of different outputs. I'll let you look at that. Hopefully you guys can see it right there. And I'm gonna um, link the product in the description. That way you guys can check it out just like I did last time. But I've had this battery a year. I use it all the time for my jacket and uh, I've used it to recharge my cell phone, power my switch for my kids. I mean, it's just a really good battery. It still works, so I don't have any complaints. So we'll just plug it into the USB port like that. Little red indicator comes on. Hopefully you can pick that up. Let you know that it's working. Plug it in like that. There we go. We're in business. So, uh, this is similar to the first adapter that uh, I had in my last video. The only difference is, which I, I really like this new one. So, I, I don't know if I have the, the old one anymore, but the old one, it was literally a USB stick like this attached right to this adapter. And then the adapter was similar to this. So basically it was this part right here. And what happened over time is just the way the adapter would flex um, in your pockets and stuff like that. Like basically like the USB part would just would break. Um, on this new one, they've kind of reinforced both sides. That way, whenever you're flexing it or moving around, sitting down, it's, it's not going to break on you is easy so I really like that one let's look at the other one this is this is probably the coolest one so look at that um, same thing I think you have to have a USB um, oh sorry I think you have to have the Q 3.0 4.0 yeah so it has to be QC 3.0 
And in the description, I'll have the link for both the adapters, and you can kind of go and look at them on your own. But just make sure that your jacket is a uh, your jacket connector is a 5.5 millimeter. Um, but this is the other one, and check that out. Look, it's a USB-C to the 5.5 millimeter jack. I love that, um, just because it takes up less real estate when you have it plugged in here. So look, look how small that is compared to the, the other one. When you have the full USB, it's sticking out a little more, and the adapter wire itself is a lot shorter, so there's less stuff in your pocket. So. Let me plug it in. Turn it on. There we go. I'm in business. So, I really like this one better um, simply because it's a little less bulky and, uh, you know, just it weighs less. Obviously, this is a heavy battery, so some people have asked in the comments, like, is it noticeable? Yes, it is noticeable, but compared to like you know some of the adapters that I've seen that like literally just take the like the Milwaukee like drill batteries um, it's not comparable to those but we'll put it in there in the front we're good to go I don't know if you can see it's pretty flat right here move it to the back There we go. So there's the back profile. Zip it up. Ready to go to work. Um, I know some of you guys were saying that there's a uh, drop off in power usage. Honestly, I can't even really tell. Like, I, I turn my jacket on when I go outside. And usually I'm never outside for 12 hours straight without going inside. So, I mean, this is enough battery for me to last all day. I charge it at night, and then in the next morning it's ready to go. So, if you're having problems running out of battery, you can get any other battery that is the QC3 or QC4. Just make sure that you look on the the um, description and the product link, um, and see if if your battery will fit with it. So, that's that's the two different adapters, and that's the update on the hack battery still works if you're inter interested in that if not there's other batteries that will work for it but um, if you waited till the end of the video as a thank you um, just leave a like or a comment and share it and I'm gonna pick one person to give one of these adapters away um, I'll just send you an email whenever I draw a winner and uh, I'll get one of these sent out to you so um, I'll, I'll do that once the video has, let's shoot for a hundred likes. If I can get a hundred likes, um, then I'm gonna pull a comment and uh, send one of you guys an adapter. And uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for my next video. Maybe I'll throw a boot video out there or some fishing stuff. And uh, subscribe, please. Thank you.